गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास हाउ आर यू येस आई एम सो फाइन सो आई होप यू ऑल आर स्टडिंग वेरी नाइसली एट योर होम वी हैव फिनिश मेनी टॉपिक्स ऑनलाइन ओनली इन दिस ईयर सो आई होप ऑल दिस वीडियोज विल रियली हेल्प यू देर दैट वी आर मेकिंग सो वट वी विल रीड हेयर दैट मीन्स मे ऑल थिंग्स वी हैव डिस्कस्ड टूडे एवरी थिंग सो वन टाइम very soon we'll have a very uh, soon we'll recall these topics one by one and then uh, we will start some problems you are asking already in the online classes so no need to say that that you come regularly because you are coming regularly now and it should be now your habit also so what we are have to read here we have read about circle we are knowing this is the shape of the circle and we have known about these members of the circle here all these things we have learned tangent one thing is there that you don't ever forget what is called second arc sector segment this is segment one time i would like to see here is that family main family of the circle all things are there radius is also there sector is also there segment is also there arc is also there all these black drawn things are the name that has been written there chord is also there it has been pointed by the arrow also circumference is so that has been pointed with the so everything here in this picture the circle has come some important things that uh, we have read about in the first chapter we have read about the theorems based on the chord second we have read based on the arc now in this week we are reading about the cyclic quadrilaterals so what are those cyclic quadrilaterals see here these all things you are known this is concentric circles don't forget this one and the blue part is called the area of ring okay then this is the chord here this is the second here okay these all things we have learned then we have learned this one important also that one that angle subtended by arc see here this one also angle subtended by arc theorem we have practiced we have solved many questions based on this and now this one angles in the semi circle is 90 degree okay we have used also in many questions this concept so this is very important chapter that's why now it's going to be over we have to read about the cyclic quadrilateral last class we have read the properties of the cyclic quadrilateral this opposite angle sums to 180 degree one more property is there it is that property here that exterior angles is equal to the interior opposite angle so in this figure the green one are uh, the angle e is the exterior angle angle a is the interior angles and they will be equal also this is the theorem this is the concept that i was wanted to discuss with you and we have solved questions on this also so here i have made one video there today so all things we have discussed now you have to just practice only at your home you keep in these things in the revision okay properly send your homeworks also every day you have to send your classwork and homework so all these things you just practice and see this video and that will be really useful for you okay i have made this wait just wait only here is that video Wait a minute. Let me explain this question here. Okay, what is given here in this question? It is given that AB is diameter of the circle and CD is parallel to AB. Here is that AB. Here is that CD. These lines are parallel. Angle DAB. That means this angle here. This angle is given twenty five degree. okay we have to find angle acd and cad okay the very conceptual question see here so now this is figure dab it is visible also where is 25 degree so we are just now going to start this here so what we have to find we have to find angle acd okay so what is given first of all given is that ए बी पैरल टू सी डी ओके एंड इट इज गिवेन दैट एंगल ए डी सी इज इक्वल टू ऑल्सो ट्वेंटी फाइव डिग्री बिकॉज ए डी ए बी इज 
25 degree and lines are parallel so by alternate interior angles that angle is also 25 degree now angle a d b that is 90 degree why because angle in the semicircle just now we have discussed also this concept we have just discussed in the slide there okay that angle here this angle is 90 degree because angle in the semicircle only see this angle a d b we have used this now this is 90 degree so we have to find angle a we have to find angle that one uh, d a b we can find it so in triangle a b d okay in triangle a b d 25 degree plus 90 degree plus angle that is a b d is equal to 180 degree that means angle a b d is equal to 180 minus 90 minus 25 that is 115 degree so angle b is equal to 65 degree now see one important that one the important one concept will come here for the cyclic quadratures all these points are con cyclic because they are lying on the circumference of the circle a b c d all are con cyclic so this is a cyclic quadrilateral obviously if it is cyclic quadrilateral that means angle b plus angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree okay very good you have remembered this so now we can say that angle b plus angle c okay so angle b plus angle c is equal to 180 degree because opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral So angle ACD is equal to 180 minus that angle B that is 65 degree so that is equal to 115 so angle ACD is equal to 115 degree we have to first part now we will prove angle CAD so for angle CAD for angle CAD we will go in triangle ACD okay we will go in triangle ACD and that will give us the second part that is angle CAD okay so in triangle ACD angle ACD plus angle ADC plus angle CAD is equal to 180 degree one is 115 degree one is 25 degree so 115 degree plus 25 degree plus angle CAD is equal to 180 degree that means angle CAD is equal to 180 minus 140 degree and that is equal to 180 minus 40 is equal to 40 degree only so angle CAD has also come that is equal to 40 degree and see we have proved using some concepts here and what are those concepts so those concepts were use of angle in the semicircle we have used okay and we have used this all things and this has been proved in this question it has been proved also so i hope you all will practice at your home and in the next class we learn something new some new topics till then all of you take care thank you class thank you very much